my favourite moments ever on this show. Ever. What's your name? Um, Malachi. How old are you, Malachi? Um, I'm nine. And where are you from? Um, London. Okay. North London. Who are you with? Um, I'm with my mum. Yeah, and that's it. <laughs> are you a bit nervous? All right, Malachi. Good luck. from deep within is only beginning to find release all oh, the time has come for my dreams to be heard they will not be pushed aside or turned into your own all oh, cause you know listen The moment that my mother would have been proud to see me accomplish. Okay, what are you going to sing? I am going to sing Whitney Houston, I Will Always Love You. Okay, good luck. Thank you. If I
Caitlin. And how old are you? I'm 18. And Caitlin, who are you here with? My mum and dad. What would it mean to you if you got through today? I've had a lot of knockbacks with at school. I got bullied quite a lot and so my dad used to always tell me like to keep going and so did my mum. So today I want to make them proud. Why were they bullying you? They just didn't really take for my singing, but hopefully you guys do. <laughs> hopefully we do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sing your heart out. Thank you. And all I remember is your bed Walking towards the airport, leaving us all in your bed I travel 1,500 miles to see you Begged you to want me but you didn't want to But piece by piece He collected me up Off the ground where you abandoned things yeah. Piece by piece He filled the holes But you burned in me At six years old And you know He never walks away He never asks for money He takes care of me by peace, he restored my faith that a man could be kind and a father could stand. He'll never walk away, he'll never break her heart, he'll take care of things. He'll love her, peace by peace, he restored my faith that a man, that a man. Could be kind, and a father should be great. Oh, she went and done it. She went and done it. I don't want to cry. He's <laughs> good. That was, that was all right. Julius Jun Obero. Ako po si Rhea Marquez. Taka si Bubaka yon. Ah, si Dental. Ah, si Bush. Ah, okay. Magkalayo. Tignan mo nga naman, kahit magkalayo at hindi ka nakakalaka, di ba, pinagtagpo kayo ng inyong mga talento at nasa isang entablado na kayo ngayon. Excited kaming lahat panoorin kayo. Good luck. Thank you. Good luck.
sharp niyang gumalaw? the group who's who's put this together uh, I'm the choreographer my name's Thea hello uh, we we've been together about five or six years um, yeah. but we've only recently brought this piece together and the reason we brought this piece together is Holly was in the Manchester attack last year um, it's been just a ridiculous journey for everybody um, but Holly herself has been absolutely amazing aren't she girls just <laughs> How does it feel to be back as part of the team dancing? It feels amazing, like, everybody has been absolutely supportive and I couldn't have asked for anything better. Brilliant. And... <laughs> How does it feel to be back in Manchester? Um, it's always difficult coming back to Manchester, but um, this is, like, the first place I've been, what's like, um, not like an arena, but it is a bit, and... So it's a big moment. A big moment. <laughs> okay, girls, absolutely every single person in this room is right behind you, and we wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Thank you. Go on, girls. Come on. Reason to believe you'll be okay. 
is when you don't feel strong enough to stand. You can uh, You know what, Holly? It is... Wow, this is difficult. You know, I I'm trying to put... To get through what you went through and come out here and turn a negative into a positive is actually quite unbelievable. <laughs> really. Because, you know, what these people did was they're cowards. And the fact that you can come on stage, do what you did, and make such a positive statement and with your friends, I'm very proud of you. In fact, I salute you. Tissue, I all the tissues. I all the tissues. Take them, take them, take them, take them, shut them up. Listen, well done. Get us crying, have them crying. Everybody's crying. Oh, man, stop it. We all wanted to say, all us judges oh, wanted to say hello to you in person. Well done. <laughs> They never do this. They never come backstage. I know. Never come backstage. Oh, <laughs> it was brave. It was emotional. How good was this? Where's the choreographer? That was quite incredible. Thank you. Good for you. Thank you. I Holly, you're a winner. <laughs> Hi. What are you going to sing for us today? With New Houston's "I Didn't Know My Own Strength." Ooh. And why that song? The lyrics is about me. I didn't know my own strength. I didn't know I could be strong and powerful on the stage. Well, good luck. Thank you. All them boys now are terrified. Mm, yeah. Lost touch with my soul. I had no way to turn. I have nowhere to go Love sight of my dream Thought it would be the end of me I, I thought I'd never find my way I thought I'd never live that way I thought I would away. I didn't know my own story And I pushed down And I talked That's a cool name. Where are you from? I'm from Savannah, Georgia. And how old are you? I'm 14. I'm 14? Oh, oh, wow. Wow. Okay, and who are you here with today? I'm here with my mom. So why have you decided to come on America's Got Talent? First off, I'm a rapper. I rap. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I started off because before I was born, my father, he was a rapper. Yeah. And, um... He died before I was born, so he couldn't really fulfill his dream. So that's what I'm, that's what I'm here to do. For him. Good. Wow. And this is something which you've written yourself? Yes, I wrote it. I was scared. I was like, I don't know if I should put this out, because I don't know if they're ready yet. <laughs> well, if you feel passionate about it, yes. this is exactly what you should be doing. Yes. Okay, so good luck with rooting Thank for you. Thank you. Yeah. Look, if he would 
would have put that gun down, then he would have been here right now. And if he would have put that gun down, then she would have been here right now. And if he would have put that gun down, then they would have been here right now. If he would have put that gun down. Listen, do you know what it's like to not have a father? No one to talk to when you get mad at your mama. I know you ain't gonna pick up the phone, I still call you. The reason that it hurt so bad, I never saw you. The way my grandma be acting, it got me losing hope. I swear to God, I hate to see her on and off the coke. She said, baby girl, this is just the way I cope. Man, all this weight up on my shoulders trying to stay afloat. But no, nah, I don't want your sympathy. I'm just telling y'all, this was really, really meant for me. This industry, really, this mama is how I really up. meant to be. That's why the labels and the TV shows, yeah, they keep on hitting me. And mama was struggling, trying to keep the lights on. And I had some snakes in my grass, yeah, those pythons. It's hard to see the silver lining when the lights off. But I know one day that I'm gonna be an icon, yeah. So I gotta keep pushing. People still hating on me, at least I know that they looking. And they see me coming up, so they peek through the bushes. But I'm just trying to raise awareness for the people that's looking. And yeah, if he would've put that gun down, then he would've been here right now. If he would've put that gun down, then she would've been here right now. And if he would've put that gun down, then they would've been here right now. If he would've put that gun down. Everybody, put your guns down. <laughs>